Six, respect wildlife. Observe wildlife from a distance. Do not follow or approach them. Never feed animals. Feeding wildlife damages their health, alters natural behaviors, and exposes them to predators and other dangers. Protect wildlife and your food by storing rations and trash securely. Control pets at all times or leave them at home. Avoid wildlife during sensitive times. Mating, nesting, raising young, or winter. This means that you should leave animals be. Do not dis disturb or feed them. Avoid approaching them during mating and avoid chasing them. They are as scared of you as you are of them. The seventh point is to be considerate of other visitors. Be thoughtful and respectful to all other campers and visitors wherever you are. Don't go blasting music because that could drown out the sound of nature, which a lot of people, when they're in nature, want to hear. Um, travel quietly, that means don't be yelling and don't be stomping your feet too much because, again, that could drown out the good sounds. The second point of leave no trace is to only go on established trails and also only camp on established campsites. You should only go on established trails because if it's not established, you will be causing harm to the plants. And also, you would also be putting yourself in danger too because you never exactly know what's on the trail. For example, there could be a cliff or a snake so that you could potentially die too. You should also only go on established campsites because you also never really know what's on there and you would also be suffocating plants and also animals if there are any, like for example, gopher holes. So that's why you should only go on established trails and camp on established campsites.